Thanks to Estes for sending me the Pro Series So Long Rocket. This is one of the, look like it's going to be a new classic. Soon to be released. I believe it's coming out on May 30th. Um, they sent me an early version of it. I think some of them leaked from what I understand. I think some of them hit the website and people placed orders. But mine is here right now. I'm going to actually open this up and show you. First of all, it's a two-stage rocket. 3,600 feet or 1,097 meters, flies on F0 to a F8 motors, on some super flights here, you got some the E16 motors to a F18, I mean F158, some great great flights can happen on this rocket, or you can do some single stage uh, flights also, this is this the uh, highest flying Estes model rocket ever, the so long, really great, it's 46 inches tall, 1.2 1.21, I can't speak today, 1.21 inch diameter, that is a minimum diameter rocket, it, it will get some high flights, this is some thick, thick body tubes, we're going to open this up and take a look at this rocket, ages 18 and above they recommend, um, yes, yeah, so this is part of the Pro Series, let's go on and get this open right now, and take a look at the parts, let's see what we got, alright, Alright, so everything is double bagged. This is a single bag. This is the front face card. Nothing else is in there. Set this right here. So we got the main bag, then all the parts are sealed in here. So they double bagged this one. Yes, he's been doing a little, you know, doing things a little different lately. Alright. Oh, they also gave me the 65th anniversary sticker. So thanks for that. So alright, let's get the let's get some parts out here. Let's take a look. See what we got. We're gonna start with these tubes. I noticed right away that these tubes are Heavy duty. I'm gonna get these out. We have the nose cone. Yeah, we have several tubes here. So, all right, there we go. We have that. I'm gonna get these building instructions out here. Let's see what all we have. So, all right. So the so long. This 46 inch tall rocket. Look like you have some printer index stock. So you have some printed pieces. You have some body tube length. You have the main body tube here at 16 inches, a tube coupler. So there's a yellow spacer in here somewhere. Decals, two sheets of those. Shock cord, streamer, actually streamer recovery for sure. 3,000 feet, yeah, you want streamer recover. There's a body tube here, another body tube. There's a green ring, engine block, I'm sure. So yeah, that's that. I don't see an engine hook. No engine hook, maybe. No engine hook. Let's start the water they doing as far as uh, retention. It says the coupler pin. Yeah, I don't see any uh, engine hook. Are we doing away with the engine hook on this one? Got your launch lug there. All right, let me take a quick glance. So, yeah, standard uh, standard building stuff. Okay, so they have a way. These little pieces here, I can see what they're doing. So those are going to get like wedged right in between the fin and the body tube on that section. I'm going to have to dig into this a little deeper later, but I just wanted to do a quick little walk through with you guys okay yeah you glue the fins directly yeah so looking pretty good here this is going to be a good rocket so I see streamer material like you attach two streamer two pieces of streamer and you double knot them as far as motor retention I was really oh I see what they're doing here okay you are taping your motors together you this is a uh, the old method well one of the methods of uh, you when you're doing your staging taping the motors stuffing them in there as far as retention, I'm still trying to see. Oh, I see what they did. The block is on the opposite end. That's pretty unique. Let me go back and take a look at that. Look like, yeah, so in this stage, look like the engine block is on the outside of the lower fins, of your booster fins, and then that's going to hold your motors in place. I see, I see. If I'm reading that correctly, I'm just going really fast, and it's going really fast, so that could be wrong, but that's the way it looks here. That's the way it looks. That's the way it looks. Okay. Okay, so to so long, man, this is going to be a cool a cool build. Now, we'll be building this one at some point. I have some stuff ahead of this right now, but those, here's all your tubes, cone, unique cone here. Kind of like a, remind me of a black brand cone. Yeah, it fits in there pretty good. They went back to plastic on this one. So there was some some rockets coming out recently and they were um some balsa showed up. So I guess they're you know using it however they please, whenever they please, depending on the rocket. 
So here's all those parts. There's that one green ring, two streamers, as I've seen in the instructions. Still elastic shock cord. I mean, this is, the elastic shock cords are good. They're good for a while. But I recently had my big, the Red Max ones break. So here are those pieces that will get wedged. What they call these pieces again? They call these just a printed stock and in, printed index stock. I saw them using them almost like fillets between the fins. I saw on there. So here we have some sheets of balsa. Like some nice balsa, nice tough balsa. It's like it's not flimsy. Oh yes, yeah, is some really dense balsa. So large fins for this guy. As you can see right there. So what else we have? So yeah, all these parts here to show that. And so yeah, no engine hook, no engine hook. These are probably my decals. Take a look at those. Yep, decals even put in this little, yeah, decal sheets here, water slides. It says so long, pretty nice, nice. So that's one. And let's take a look at this one. Oh, you can, here's your other ones. Yeah, really nice design on this rock. I really like this. I like what they did with this. I already can see that I'm probably going to go bright. I like the black, but I'm probably going to go, um, I'm going to go bright. I think I'm going to go bright here and maybe bright on a couple of these fins. I do like the white though, but I'm going to go bright with something, either a uh, fluorescent orange or red. I can make, I mean, I don't have many red and right, red and white rockets. I may just go all red here. A couple red fins, a couple white fins. We'll see. We'll see. I'll decide on that later, but this is all the parts. Um, it's skill level. It's an advanced advanced rocket I guess for that altitude they want you to be you know experienced in this hobby a little bit because that is a serious altitude you're going to get like 3,000 feet so this is the highest flyer highest flying rocket ever produced by Estes so pretty cool stuff shot cord like I said two streamers I like the two streamers that's pretty neat They're pretty neat fins are we a little warped or these flat Ooh, it's a little bent just notice fins a little bent Slightly, just a little. It's not too bad. Not too bad. It might, it may work. Yeah, just a little. It's not, not bad. It's not bad actually. Yeah, it's not bad. It's a slight bend to it though. Slight bend. And the fix, the way to fix that, guys, you can dump your whole fin, this whole fin, whatever one is, just sink it in water. Leave it there. Let it get saturated. Take it out. Heavy books or something heavy in between. But you know, you want to put a line of plastic or something so it don't mess up the book or whatever. But just something heavy or weights or whatever. And that'll um, straighten it out. If it needs, just repeat it. Um, and that, that'll uh, take care of your warp fins. But yeah, guys, just wanted to share these parts with you of the So Long. Thanks to Estes for sending me an early release. For sending me the rocket early. I appreciate that. And just wanted to show you guys the parts and what's in store and what's coming. 3,000 feet this one will go. So have a big recovery area for this. Big recovery area for this rocket. Um, 46 inches tall. 1.21 inches diameter, streamer recovery. So that's all for today on this one. Subscribe to the channel. Check the links below. Um, check the videos at the end of this video. I continue to bring you content, launches, tips, tricks, everything. It's Model Rocks 321. And we will see you guys on another video. So long.